Hey, Brian from Garage Mahal. Today I have this Wow Zone LHC050. It is a remote control voice intercom off road, three speed, 2.4G uh, remote control car with a camera on it. I mean, how awesome is that? So let's open this up. Wow Zone makes some pretty incredible stuff. So let me just get this out. Charger, okay, battery packs, all sorts of fun. Okay, so that is the plastic that houses everything. So that is, I mean, that thing looks pretty, pretty awesome. I mean, take a look at that. So that gives you all four sides, the underneath. So that is like an alignment control here for your steering. So if your steering gets banged up a little bit, you can kind of readjust that. That's your controller, your phone screen, holder. Okay, so let's open this up. So this is your battery charger. your battery charger and you have a little screwdriver that comes with it so that's great this is your instruction manual how to use let's get the batteries out of the pack so that's one battery second one pretty awesome and let's get one of these packs charging so here is the the wire then you have, you kind of have like a little notch at the top and you got the two, two little pins. So kind of can only go in one way. So that's great. We'll plug this in. Lights up red. And my delusion is it'll either turn uh, green or it'll go out completely when that's fully charged. Then that is your second char cell, cell battery. So pretty neat. So this is your remote. At the bottom of your remote, you have a little battery compartment. So that's what the screwdriver is for as well. So let's take this open. Get that little screw out. And then it takes two double A's. Let's get those. So, I got two double A's right here. All right, then we just put this compartment in. Let me put the screw back on. And there we go. We'll screw that down. Okay, and then this little guy goes on top of here, and that is what we use to hold our cell phone that acts as our screen. So that goes up pretty big. So that should hold my phone. I got a pretty wide phone, yeah. So it holds my phone pretty easy. Just give you kind of an idea. That's great. And now let's get back over to our truck here. And we've only been charging for a little bit, but just for demo purposes, I'll plug that other battery in, get that one going. So your battery pack is going to go down like this. Okay, so what I found out on this is you just can't just plop the battery in and, and like tighten it down. What you kind of have to do is because it's a little on the tight side you got to kind of like wiggle it a little bit and you'll kind of feel it find its like home and once you do that uh, just tighten down a little bit on each side and just kind of like slowly work the battery down into its position and you'll kind of like feel all slip into place so definitely uh, 
take some time doing that. And then when you turn that on, uh, you'll see the little blue light in there. Let me get the right angle. So that's going on. It's waiting to connect with the remote control. So what we can do is turn on the remote. Just click that on. And you'll see it want to move forward. Initialization completed. I'll tell you, initialization is complete. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's see how we connect the camera to the phone. So in here, it's going to have some QR codes to link. So we are going to take this off camera, and we're going to scan the Android, because we're using an Android phone. And at the bottom, you have can select English and we'll select download address one. Right, we'll hit download, download. So as you can see it's downloading, it's taking a little bit. It's a 75 meg file so will take a couple seconds to download. Alright, so the uh, the app is just about done downloading, so let's just, uh, I was playing around with this on the, the desk here, so it kind of easily goes over a little stack of laptops I have sitting on the, uh, on the desk, so that's a lot of fun. Okay, so the app's got less than uh, 15 seconds left to go. Okay, so uh, the app is done downloading, so we're going to install it. Give you kind of an idea it's installing. Okay, so we're going to open that, and then that is what you get. We're going to hit play, and we're just going to hit allow. So it's going to be looking to make a connection. So LH car is what we're going to be looking for. So let's open up our Wi-Fi. And then on the Wi-Fi you'll see LH car and then whatever serial number is. But as long as you find LH car, then it's going to be like serial so-and-so. So it's looking for the stability of your internet connection. So we can go back in. Okay, so after the initialization process, we go into play, and then you'll see it connect. So that is pretty cool. So that is a car. So we can like uh, take a picture. Okay, like record some video. So that's pretty neat. And then you have your. So I can set that up on my remote. So pretty cool. Let's go down on the floor. So I'll give you kind of a bird's eye view of what it's seeing. Seeing all the boxes on the floor. Anyway, uh, we'll have some of the footage that we captured on this. Uh, the camera you can put pretty much any way. You can angle it any way you want to. So it kind of like give you a point of view, POV straight ahead. You can have it angled kind of up. So as you're like zipping around, you can kind of like see where you're at. A lot of fun. Absolutely love this thing. Um, other than that, uh, stay tuned for the, the live footage.
Byron from Garage Hall. Thanks for watching and be safe out there.